On the next DM. And 10 mil, let's see. I don't want to pop the pistol. We both grown. We could talk out issues. But just in case you got too much bass, I'm going to bring two sticks like a popsicle. The mag is big, but the Glock little. The bag is big, but the block little. You niggas be rushing to die. I'm taking my time. I'm going to outlive you. You niggas be blowing the whistle off. Know everything like you see through a crystal ball. Know what they did and you know what they did to y'all. You know about every bitch in the city, dog. Groovy ass niggas, I got to get rid of y'all. Play from a distance, won't be in the midst of y'all. Get to acting like bop if you piss me off. Ah, acting like bop if you piss me off. I'm about to wear out your whiskey, y'all. Yeah. Huh. When I grab you by the whiskers and rip them all. Welcome to Big Boy's Noise. What's going on, Noisy Neighbors? You already know it's your boy, Big Boy Noise. And yes, it is my birthday, okay? I'm right here with my man, Buddy Root, Jelly Bean himself. And we are in Bear Country. Um, as you can look at the environment. <laughs> Yes, where we are shooting at today is Bear Country. And yes, today I will be running the XD Elite, XDM Elite Bear Stopper. Today we're gonna find out if this gun is really unbearable. Y'all stay tuned. It's 10 millimeter time. Noisy neighbors, just pulling up here. The sound of the gunfire is like music to my ears. Just hearing the guns in the background. Pow, pow, pow. It's like music in my ears, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, did I say it was my birthday? It's my actual birthday today, so um, money sign big boys noise. That's money sign big boys noise. If you want to cash at me a dollar and say happy birthday, two dollars and say yo a shot on me. If you want to cash at me five dollars and say yo take a shot on me tonight, big boy noise. Whatever y'all choose to do, you can feel free to do that. You hear the guns in the background? But yeah, money sign big boys noise. Today is my birthday. And congratulations today, um, my brother Osama been smoking received his poly ammo pot. And um, he's stepping out of the poly ammo circle, so we're going back down to a hundred twenty dollar pot for a little while. He's stepping out, but he'll be back due to some employment things for him. But today he received his pot, and now he's officially out until he returns. You hear it? I love it, baby. Make some noise. All right, there we noisy neighbors. Here we are in the middle of bear country. As you see, I am packing my bear gun. It's being concealed right now, but it's time to put this thing to the test. You can't conceal nothing that you never put to the test in case a bear really does come. For some reason, my glasses seem a little crooked, but we'll get to the bottom of that too. But anyway, guys, here we go. We're gonna be running this 10 millimeter. We're gonna start with the heavy stuff. We're going to see how it does with the 200 grain hard cast bear stopper rounds from about 15 yards. So it's about 15 yards from where I'm actually shooting from. See, Jelly Bean is there at about 10 yards. And I'm going to be running from here at about 15 yards. So um, happy birthday to me. And let's get it. All right, noisy neighbors. Your boy, big boy noise. Let's get right to it. 10 millimeter bear gun. Dry straight out the box. You know how I like to run it. We're going to be running some of this double tap hard cast. Let's see how it holds up. Look how long that casing is. That's a lot of gunpowder in that casing. That's a hot round for both black, brown, and white bears. You know, those polar bears do exist also. You never know where you end up at. But I'm going to go straight from here. <laughs> and I'm going to put a couple down range. Let's just run this bad boy dry and see what it's all about. Run an XDM. And 10 mil. Let's see. First group of five shots that ran good dry. Um, I noticed I'm aiming at the bullseye. It shot maybe two or three inches low, but it's right dead center. It's just a teeny bit low, and I think that's just about me adjusting to the grip handle of this XDM, learning a brand new platform. But um, I'm going to turn it around so you can see all five of those, one, two, three, four, five, six, all six of those shots are, are dead on, dead center from about 15 yards. Let me let you see. Hopefully you guys can see from here now, that's dead center. I mean, for a 10 millimeter, that's good stuff. Especially first five shots out the box. 200 grain. That's the hot stuff right there. So let's keep getting warmed up with it. All right, guys. I'm going to throw five more. This time, I'm going to try to put them in the red. Or a couple of them in the red. It's about 15 yards. Oh, that was 
Very, very accurate, guys. Listen, I think I just shot about four or five. At least three of them dead in the red. And the other two a little higher. Let me let you see. Birthday boy right, at, right back at you. All right, so noisy neighbors. We're looking at the first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. The first 12 shots fired. Oh, man, these are big bullet holes. I love it. The first 12 shots fired from the uh, XDM 10 millimeter Elite. 200 grain double tap hard cast bear stopping ammo totally unbearable totally unbearable so as you see in the beginning it was one low but the others were like i was shooting the first five were like in this area here they were like one two three four five a little low or like six the first six were like a kind of low but then the next six i shot were like i think like one two three four five you see the three and right in the dead in the red that's good and the other two were a little higher just getting used to just getting used to the uh the, the the different firearm itself but i tell you you feel the strength there's something sweet about a 10 millimeter round you really feel a thump but it's in a really smooth way i guess the way that uh springfield uh carved out their chassis that frame of that pistol really makes it a beautiful thump it's not like a thump like it hurts your hand or vibrate no it's like a you just feel that you're shooting something strong it's really hard to explain it but it seems like a really fun and a very accurate gun if you look at this I mean, for 15 yards, this is good shooting, regardless. This is where you want to aim at. This is what you want to be hitting at with a charging bear, okay? But anyway, even, even more detailed than that, the 200 grain ammo, to be able to put three dead center, dead bullseye, that's like hitting a bear dead in his eye. You know what I mean? That, that's good stuff, man. I'm impressed. Let's have some more fun. Noisy neighbors, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And like I said before, Cash App, Money Sign, Big Boy's Noise. It's my birthday. Put $2 in that Cash App. Buy me a drink for the night. Your boy. Money Sign, Big Boy's Noise. I'm serious. <laughs> Let's go. Let's turn up. Okay, noisy neighbors. I'm just going to let all seven shots go. I'm still shooting the 200 grain hot rounds of the 10 mil. I'm just going to shoot seven more of them, and then I'm going to transfer over to some uh, different. I'm going to transfer over to some arm score. Unbearable, baby. Totally unbearable. I like it. Noisy neighbors. Make some noise. I like that. Really, really impressed. Um, done running a, a 200 grain double tap. What we're going to run now is some 180 grain. Oh, so cool. magazines actually hold 16 rounds so 16 plus one that's 17 rounds of 10 millimeter too bad but i'll tell you one thing it is a clear difference in the 200 grain compared to the uh, 180 grain the 200 grain is definitely more accurate than the 180 grain although the 180 grain is still dead center the groups is a little bit wider but i'm gonna tighten that up y'all stay tuned but as far as functionality goes as far as functionality goes so far so good ran through about two mags so far and um Bone dry is running everything. It wouldn't be my birthday without a mag dump, would it?
Hey guys, we just came back from a cold range and I looked down at my firearm and look what Buddy Rude blessed me with. Check this out. I looked down at my firearm. Look what I seen up underneath of it. Oh, not just one, a 50 smack, but, but two 50 smacks. Hey! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Thanks a lot, Dad. That's what I'm talking about. It's, it's my birthday, baby. like I told y'all. Cash app. Money sign, big boy noise. Put $2 in my cash app if you got love for your boy. Or five, whatever. Enough to buy you a drink. Maybe a cheesesteak. Let's go. All right, guys. You've seen both of these guns before. I'm just going to have a little bit of fun with them. Might not get too much footage. Nothing, nothing real detailed. Just going to have a little fun out here on my birthday. Just enjoying myself. So I thank you guys all for joining me during my birthday. I'll leave you with a little couple clips of me shooting these nine millimeters having a little fun but i'm not gonna do a lot of target detailing but um i love you guys and like i said man it's my birthday send your boy some shot money all right some drink money all right i don't care two dollars in the cash app whatever you choose money sign big boys noise that's money sign big boys noise on cash app until the next time make some noise You got to make sure they, they cycling well. You know what I mean, my man? <laughs> you got to make sure they cycling well. A very accurate shooting of that house. Jelly bean with a precision. With that beautiful 357 bass stopper. It Talking. is, baby. Speaking of bass stoppers, you know what I mean? What's going on here? You hit the bottom diamond now. Oh, that was nice. That's a good shot where you put that one at.